All right, so when I travel, I like to try to pick up photo books. So these are the books that I picked up while we were traveling in Moscow. They all come from the same shop, which I mentioned in my uh, Moscow Film Things overview video. And I figure I would talk through one of these now and I might do a video on the others later. So as I was trying to think through which one of these I wanted to talk about first, what I decided is that I would talk about this one on Kamchatka. Kamchatka is like the far, far east of Russia. It's a peninsula. Uh, Kamchatka is a really remote place. It's also a very interesting place uh, and a place that I've wanted to go for a long time but haven't had that chance. However, in July, so a couple months from now, we will be actually taking a trip to Kamchatka. All right, so this book is called Dininvnik. Kamchatka, which means Diary of Kamchatka. And let's see here. Interesting enough, it doesn't actually have the uh, photographer or author or anything listed on the outside, but it looks like it's from uh, Ivan Shamatov. I like this image, the composition the contrast in it is something that speaks to me. And this is probably one of my favorites. When I look at this, you just get this sense of a really solid group of guys. It feels very much like it's a diary. We see here them preparing before they leave port with kind of some of their maintenance activities, definitely giving you a peek inside the life of a fisherman. This image just has such motion and energy behind it. It's really moving. You can see the lines moving. I love how they've included letters in here. I think that really delivers on this theme of a diary. Another image that's almost like it's otherworldly with, you know, an orca coming up to the ship. You see orcas out in the distance in the lower image. This image or these sets of four images is something I enjoy. I love the motion and the sense of pace and frenzy that comes with it. Saying goodbye to your loved ones and then a peek into everyday life on a ship after work. This image is another one that's very otherworldly. It's hard to connect with, to see something so remote. But I love the contrast here and the textures in this image. It truly is like it's almost from another planet. This image has such texture to it. It really adds to this thought of a journal that's been well used and well thumbed through, that hasn't been babied. Those memories of those. This image of recreation time on the vessel, on the ship, playing some tetherball. I like these two images, but I really especially like the image on the bottom here. It has such emotion to it for me. You have this sharp contrast difference between the sea and then the misty fog above and the clouds and these birds. This is what they all go back to. This is what they see when they go home. So very different from the ship. All right, so I hope you enjoyed the flip through this as much as I did. And let me know what you think. 
I think that's about it for today. So you guys take it easy and we'll talk to you later. Peace.